Hello and welcome to the Provider Information Session for the New South Wales Government's First Lap Voucher Program. My name is Philippa Taylor and I'm the Director of Policy and Programs at the New South Wales Office of Sport. The Office of Sport is proud to deliver the First Lap Voucher Program, which aims to make water safety education more accessible for families in New South Wales. The purpose of today's session is to walk you through the First Lap Voucher Program. I will provide an overview of the objectives, eligibility criteria, some key differences between the First Lap and Active Kids programs, the provider registration and onboarding process, and where you can access more information. Let's get started. The First Lap Voucher Program provides $100 vouchers to contribute towards the cost of swimming lessons. Children's eligibility for the program was originally announced as being aged three to six years and not enrolled in school. Since then, the Premier has announced the inclusion of children in kindergarten in 2021 and children starting kindergarten in 2022 in recognition that they have missed out on vital water safety education during their preschool years due to COVID-19 restrictions. The first lap voucher can be redeemed at time of payment for a child's swimming lessons with an approved first lap provider. Eligible children will have access to one voucher valued up to $100 each financial year. Vouchers will expire at the end of the financial year of release on 30 June. While the first voucher will be released with the launch of the program on 1 December 2021 and expire on 30 June 2022, the second year's voucher will be released on 1 July 2022 and be available for 12 months. First Lap has two primary objectives. The first is to increase the number of preschool aged children who did not participate in a Learn to Swim program within the past 12 months participating in Learn to Swim programs. The second is to build knowledge and awareness of parents, carers and guardians of the importance of preschool aged children learning to swim. While the program objectives remain limited to outcomes for preschool aged children and their parents, carers and guardians, as previously noted, the program has been expanded for the 2021-22 financial year to include children in kindergarten in 2021 and children starting kindergarten in 2022. To register as a provider with the First Lap program, you must deliver a structured and supervised Learn to Swim program over a minimum of five sessions. This can be delivered through either an intensive or a weekly program. To be approved as a First Lap provider, you must be based in New South Wales, hold a current ABN or ACN, and must not have any outstanding actions or enforcement orders recorded by the Office of Fair Trading. Obtain working with children check clearances for all staff and all volunteers who will work with children involved in the First Lap program. Hold current insurance appropriate to the program being delivered and ensure all swimming instructors who will be involved in the First Lap program delivery hold a current Royal Life Saving Society, Ofswim or Australian Swimming Coaches and Teachers Association licence. Providers operating in rural or remote areas of New South Wales and those working with children with disabilities who believe they may not meet the program eligibility are encouraged to discuss their circumstances with the New South Wales Office of Sport before applying to become a first lap provider. Vouchers can be used for either intensive or weekly swimming lessons. The swimming lessons must be part of a structured and supervised program of at least five lessons given by a swimming teacher in a safe and suitable swimming facility. Programs that take place in moving bodies of water, in water with potential underwater hazards, or in water with low visibility are not eligible for first lap vouchers. In addition, first lap providers cannot redeem vouchers for centre membership fees that are not part of a structured program, casual visit passes, any sessions not in a safe and suitable swimming facility, travel to and from sessions, 
any virtual or online program and individual items or equipment such as swimmers, goggles and flippers. The first lap and active kids programs are two different voucher programs with separate application processes. Approved active kids providers still need to apply to participate in the first lap program. Active kids vouchers are only available to school aged children, whereas first lap vouchers are only available to preschool aged children, with a temporary expansion to include children in kindergarten. First lap vouchers can only be used for swimming lessons, whereas active kids vouchers can be used for a range of sports and active recreation activities. In addition, first lap vouchers are eligible to use for intensive swimming lessons over a number of days, whereas active kids programs must be delivered over a minimum of eight weeks. The first lap program uses a newer service New South Wales voucher platform, which means the application program management and redemption processes are different compared to Active Kids, which uses an older voucher platform. To register as a first lap provider, you will need to visit the Service New South Wales website and type first lap into the search bar. Then click on the link which says register as a first lap provider. This page on the website outlines the information and documents you will need to complete your application, including two personal identity documents, such as an Australian driver license, Medicare card or Australian passport, your business details, being the ABN or ACN, name, address and phone number. Please note that your identity document name details must match the name details held with the Australian Business Register for your ABN. If these details do not match, a letter of authority must be provided. Insurance details, including name of insurer, policy number, expiry date and certificate of currency. Two evidence of business documents. Full name, date of birth, swimming accreditation information and working with children check number for all staff and all volunteers who will work with children in the first lap program. Swimming program details, including lesson plans, program fees and activity location. Business bank account details for the account that will take reimbursements. When you submit your registration, you will receive a confirmation email. If more information is required to support your registration, you will be notified. Once the New South Wales Office of Sport has assessed your application, we will email you with the outcome. If you are approved as a first lap provider, you will be able to accept and redeem vouchers from 1 December 2021 through the Service New South Wales for Business app. To do this, you will need a phone or tablet to scan and accept vouchers through this app. You will be able to connect your swim location to your device through a unique code. If you have more than one swim location, you will get a unique code for each one. A new code will become available once you have added a location to your device. Once you have connected a device to your location, your swim location will appear in the business finder and your customers will know that they can redeem their vouchers with you. You will be able to download promotional assets, including flyers and social media graphics to encourage your customers to redeem their first lap vouchers with you. Your staff can start accepting vouchers from customers from 1 December 2021. Customers can show you a digital or printed voucher or they can read out a voucher code for you to enter manually into the app. For more information, please visit the First Lap page on the Office of Sport website at sport.nsw.gov.au forward slash First Lap. For assistance with your application, please contact the Office of Sport's First Lap team at firstlap at sport.nsw.gov.au. Thank you for watching and for considering applying to become a First Lap provider.